Hello class, this is Beck, and today I would like to talk about collocations with you. As you might know, and as you might remember, collocations is a uh, two words that go together. For example, you know, verb plus noun collocation. So, do homework, make an appointment, or adjective plus noun collocations. Um, heavy rain, a strong wind, or a blonde girl. You know, we have many, many collocations. And as you might recall, I think in reading and writing or reading vocabulary class, you, you've you talked about collocations, right? But in today's tutorial, I would like to talk about a tool that can help you improve your collocations um, in writing lab. So the name of the tool is word and phrase dot info. You can see it on the screen. And this is the tutorial about word and phrase info. In order to find uh, word and phrase info, you can Google it. So as you can see, word and phrase dot info. When you Google it, you will find this kind of screen. And there are two things here, but you need to click frequency list. So click, after you click, you will see this kind of screen. And you have to pay really attention to like two things. First, word. You have to type word here and search. So that's it. It's very easy. And the question is, how can I use this tool to help with my collocation? Well, and this tutorial will help you to learn about it. So imagine I want to know collocates or collocations for the word appointment. So I type the word appointment and I search. And I will have, I will have this kind of screen. So and in this screen, there are a lot of information. And you can see here is the word. And it's showing me that the word appointment is a noun. It also gives me definitions. It also gives me collocates or collocations. Also, it gives me example sentences, all these colorful things. But I really want to know what verb or what verbs can I use with the word appointment. Well, it's easy to find. If you would like to know which verb I can use with collocations, then you can go directly to the collocate section in this website. And as you can see, I, can, I have a couple of verb choices. So if we make it kind of bigger, you can see collocates and verb choices. So what my verb choices are make an appointment, announce an appointment, keep an appointment, schedule, set, cancel, miss, accept, arrive, attend. I also have a couple of example sentences. Remember to read example sentences because they really give you a lot of information. Imagine I have this sentence. Yesterday, I did not make my homework. I think there is something wrong with this sentence. Make homework. It's not a correct collocation. So I need to find a correct verb collocation for the word homework. So I type the word homework. And the system tells me that this is a noun. And if I look at the collocation section of word and phrase dot info, it gives me these choices. Do, complete, finish, assign, read, eat, check, weigh. I can also read example sentences, by the way. So let me read some of them. Doing homework. Do their homework. Did his homework. So it looks like do homework is the correct collocation. So let me correct my sentence. Yesterday, I did not do my homework. Do homework is the correct collocation. Let's solve one more problem. But this time, it is adjective plus noun collocation problem. I do not like quick food. There is something wrong with this sentence. Quick food. So quick is an adjective, food is a noun. So let me find a correct adjective for the word food. I type the word food because I'm looking for an adjective for the word food. And I know that food is noun. 
So here's the collocation section of the word and phrase dot info website. Collocates. So instead of going directly to collocates, let me also read example sentences. What adjectives I can use with the word food? Chinese food, cooked food, <laughs> this is funny, fatty foods. So I have these choices. Okay, what are some choices? Wow, here I have lots of choices. Fast food, healthy food, organic food, favorite food, Chinese, Mexican, rich, fried, fatty, Italian. I think I know which adjective I can use. So let me go to my sentence and let me correct it. I think fast food is a correct choice. I do not like fast food. I hope you found this tutorial helpful. If you have any questions about word and phrase info, watch this tutorial or just ask me questions. Good luck and enjoy using this website. Bye.